Am I the asshole? For screaming at my sill for eating my pregnancy craving and then being pissed she didn't replace it. English isn't my first language so I might have trouble and there will be spelling errors. I and my husband have been trying to have a kid for 5 years and I recently found out I was pregnant so far in 25 weeks. I my cravings recently kicked in and the only thing I want is literally Hawaiian pizza. Today I was craving it all day so I got one from Papa John's and I also got some breadsticks. I had three slices and then decided to take a nap. I woke up at 7.50 and wanted to get another slice and some breadsticks when I did there was none left I was reasonably upset as I had been craving it. I then asked husband and Sil which one of them ate my pizza. Sil admitted that she had ordered it and that she was hungry and pretty tired from work Sil goes to work from 7.00 am to 5.00 pm. I screamed at Sil and told her to replace it immediately Sil refused and said that I am acting ridiculous. I started crying and husband calmed me down and ordered me a pizza. Sil thinks I'm an asshole so am I? Edit wow I didn't expect to get this many responses I will try to answer more questions. Edit I have been reading some of the comments from two of my questions and was recommended to edit this in. Sil has done this before where I have gotten food and have made it crystal clear that it's for me and she still hate this has gone on even before I got pregnant. What makes people think they can just eat other people's food? Not the asshole. Not the asshole, she ate the rest of your food without asking you? That's rude AF. She ate over half a pizza that wasn't hers, and she didn't even leave any? And then refused to get you another? Utterly ridiculous. Even my boyfriend knows better. Not the asshole. Who eats the rest of someone's food without asking, much less a pregnant person's. Probably didn't need to yell, but hormones are real. Edit spelling. If someone ate my pizza while I was asleep, I'd be pissed even if I am not pregnant. And I'd be even more pissed if they didn't agree to replace it. Pregnancy cravings or not, eating people's stuff is in general not cool. Your reaction may have been more emotional than you intended, but you're not wrong. Not the asshole. Not the asshole, it's so weird that people here hates pregnant people. The craving for some food while pregnant, is like craving for water when you are thirsty. And hormones do much too. And you can't eat a lot when you're pregnant because your stomach is smaller because of the baby. And your sill was living with you and your husband so she should have no better. She probably knows you like that pizza more than anything and still decided to eat it. What a nah. Added not the asshole. I'm not pregnant and I'd yell at someone for not asking, eating my food and not replacing it. Not the asshole. Even ignoring the fact that you're pregnant. Who the hell eats other people food without asking and then have the audacity to say they're not replacing. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. The pregnancy is completely irrelevant. She ate your food, she should replace it. Even if you weren't pregnant I'd say not the asshole, Papa John's is bomb and you should ask before taking someone else's food. Also who the fuck eats over half a pizza they didn't buy and refused to buy another? Didn't even give you money for the nearly entire pizza she ate? What an asshole. Not the asshole. There are 10 slices in a Papa John pizza. UA3. Who eats 7 slices and the rest of the breadsticks? Seriously. The men I know couldn't do that. Then okay if she ate it she should have apologized and ordered you another. It's a dang pizza. Not the asshole it sounds like you've had this issue with her even before you were pregnant. It's not a pregnancy reaction. It's a legitimate reaction to having something stolen from you and then it being brushed aside as if they did nothing wrong. If you hadn't mentioned being pregnant, no one would think you're DA. But lately there's been a ton of ridiculous pregnant women on here. Not the asshole, don't eat other people's food for one. Not the asshole for pregnancy hormone yelling. Not the asshole. I assume the pizza had 8 slices, leaving 5. That leads me to understand Sil ate more than half the pizza all the breadsticks. Even if the spouse said Sil could eat some pizza, she ate most of the food in total. Sil was inconsiderate and then doubled down by not replacing the food she pigged out on knowing full well it wasn't hers to finish off. Nta. I can't stand such blatant inconsideration. People just want to be respected, why is that so hard for some people to understand? Not the asshole who just eats someone else's food. In college once, a friend of my roommates cooked and ate a frozen pizza of mine without asking. He said he'd replace it. After months of him not doing anything, and three days before the end of the school year, I went to his room and stole his PlayStation 2. After about an hour or so, he had my fucking pizza. This has nothing to do with your story, I was just reminded.
Not the asshole. Not the asshole. Why is your silly eating your leftover food? I could see having two to four slices but to eat all of it was a complete awe move on her part. Most of us respect someone else's leftovers if it wasn't specifically bought to be shared with the household, at least for the first three days. It'd be telling her to go home and eat her own food, and having a conversations about boundaries and not stealing someone else's private takeout. Not the asshole it's common to ask if the food isn't yours. That goes for sill food too. Not the asshole. If you just removed the part that you were pregnant, everyone would have said that she has no right to your food without asking. But people here hate pregnant women and would hate it if you would ever get a pass for anything. When I was pregnant, Subway put onions in my sandwich and I cried for half an hour, thankfully I was at home. They will never understand how it feels, and how horribly hard it is to contain your emotions in those moments. Why was Syl there and eating you all's food anyways? Greedy and disrespectful. If Syl had asked brother, he should have known that was his wife's and told his sister to not touch it. So not the asshole but Syl is for just eating your food she didn't buy. Not the asshole. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 slice left. It wasn't hers, she didn't ask you and it was yours, even asking her brother doesn't matter. Don't touch other people's things. Nta. She ate 5 slices and the breadsticks. Then refused to replace them. I'd have got snippy. Not the asshole. Some of you all have never been pregnant and it shows. Literally all of our human emotions not pregnant are chemicals and hormones. Not things we just control. Now put that 100x. Not the asshole. When we order pizza, my husband and I each order our own pizza and we eat that. The leftovers from those pizzas belong to the one who ordered it, unless we talk about it and change it. We don't just take the food someone else had plans for. We also both keep special things in the house that are just for the one who bought it. I have some nice chocolates, he has a few boxes of a snack he really likes from home but can't get here. If my sill came and ate my special chocolate, I would be mad. If she lived in my house rent free and did it often, I might tell at her. Not the asshole. My uncle is currently living with us. He stays with us at least 3-4 times a week. He started staying with us around February 2022. For the first few months, he smoked inside, used our clothes without permission, ate some of our own specified food we bought BC of cravings, stole money from me rearranged our living room to his liking etc. I can sympathize with op. Sill is rude. Not the asshole. Info. Do you live with Sill and do you share food? ESH it was rude of her to eat your food, but your reaction was just inappropriate. There's very few situations where screaming is an appropriate response for an adult. Pregnancy, hormones, yada yada, I get it, but it's still not an excuse to act a fool you're going to be a mother. Grow up. Not the asshole. She's not entitled to your food. Doesn't even matter that you're pregnant with cravings. Nah man she took her food without replacing it that ah move on her part. Not the asshole. You're still ate over half of your pizza and all the breadsticks that's so rude. It doesn't matter if you're pregnant or not, it's just plain rude. Should you have yelled? Maybe not. But your sill is definitely tie in this situation. Not the asshole. She would never ever be allowed in my home again. That's super disrespectful. Shame on your husband for not correcting her. Not the asshole. My brother constantly ate leftovers when we lived in the same house. It drove me up a wall. If I bought food and did not say you can eat it, then don't touch it. The sill can buy her own pizza if she wanted some. Not the asshole. You are never the asshole for screaming at someone for eating your pizza. Nta. When I was pregnant I had to have my specific foods in the house at all times. If anyone ate them I would have a meltdown because I would be vomiting non-stop, couldn't eat anything else and I wouldn't be able to sleep until I'd eaten whatever I was craving. Being pregnant can be exhausting. Not the asshole. Eating a bit is one thing, if it was just a slice too I would say everyone sucks, but she ate 5 whole slices of pizza and breadsticks? I would be mad too. I've gotten into some serious arguments with my family over my food. I don't blame you one bit especially since you're pregnant. Why is your sill okay with eating food she's didn't make or buy? I'm guessing it was an 8 slice pizza which means she ate most of your pizza without asking. Not the asshole. But just a heads up, since this has happened once already, start leaving notes on things you get for yourself with your own money. Also, being pregnant isn't an excuse to yell at people. Not the asshole your food is just that, yours. From here on out however, you may want to label it.
like with a Mr. Yuck sticker, so everyone knows it's yours and not to touch it. Not the asshole. That's your food. Did she ask for some or pay for it? Even if you weren't pregnant you'd still have a right to be upset about this. She took your food. Yes you 100 could have handled it better. I'll give you benefit of doubt and say between probably having pregnancy exhaustion, food cravings, and waking up hungry you reacted normal. Still I'd come back to it later when calm and explain calmly why I'm upset. Not the asshole, all of what was left was 5 slices plus breadsticks I can see having some, but who hogs out on over half. Damn this sub really hates pregnant women and is full of hypocrisy. Sill has taken all of Op's food before multiple times and isn't even paying rent. She's being allowed to live there and can't be respectful or take care of herself? Like get food for yourself before you come home or the day before even. It's not anyone else's responsibility to feed her. She's not a baby. Not the asshole I'm not pregnant and I would flip shit on someone if they ate my food that I paid for without asking, who does that and thinks it's okay, it's not okay. I don't understand all the votes otherwise, yay you yelled a bit so what, they stole from you then refused to replace it when confronted. Why do half of the people on this thread think that's okay? No judgment, but I can understand you very well. You can go out and destroy the whole city, I don't care, but if you eat my food, you better watch your back from now on. And I will remember it years later. Don't touch my food, just don't. Not the asshole it's rude to eat the last of anything that you didn't personally buy. Both Sil and Husbess ND should know that as adults. Also Sil's refusal to replace it totally makes her an ah. Or husband not stepping up to the plate if he okayed Sil eating most of a pizza neither of them but. Edit also they should know that by 25 weeks pregnant you're gonna eat small meals and often can eat a lot of foods between food aversion, nausea, and heartburn. She basically ate your limited diet food.